The Prime Minister has led tributes to the former Scottish Conservative leader David McCletchie, who died today after suffering from cancer. David Cameron described him as one of Scottish politics' most formidable intellects. The current Scottish Tory leader, Ruth Davidson, said that his passing left a large hole in Scottish public life. Our political editor, Brian Taylor, looks back on his life. A traditional Tory, but never pompous, never stuffy. David McCletchy battled persistently for his party and for Scotland's interests as he saw them. The fault lies not with the achievements of the government, which in this field are magnificent. From early days as a party activist, devolution brought him to prominence and the Scottish Tory leadership. David McCletchy received 91 votes. Now for David McCletchy was ele elected leader of the Scottish Conservative Parliamentary Group. The struggling Tories knew they had to grab the attention of the voters. The key thing was to get it noticed, to become a player again in uh, Scottish uh, politics. David McCletchie was certainly noticed, lampooning the First Minister Henry MacLeish over his office expenses. I didn't can, it was not me, a big boy did it and ran away. Henry MacLeish duly resigned, but four years later, expenses, this time for taxes, landed David McCletchie himself in trouble. Facing claims he had charged Parliament for trips on party business, he quit as leader. For some, that might have been the end, but David McCletchie steadily regained his reputation, partly through diligent, intelligent parliamentary work, not least as his party's business manager, and partly because he was affable and widely liked. The whole world smiles with you. Few politicians could look entirely at ease serenading a bus party. David McCletchie could. The vagaries of politics. In 2003, David McCletchie had proudly won a constituency. And I declare that David William McCletchie... Although he later needed the list again to stay in Holyrood. In either guise, as a lawyer, he was highly skilled in parliamentary debate, including forensic scrutiny of new legislation and the Scottish Government's response. I think it is a fig leaf to cover up the uh, government's uh, embarrassment, uh, that its uh, table thumping has frankly come to absolute naught. David McCletchie had a hinterland, family man, golfer, Hearts fan. His party and Scotland's Parliament will miss him. David McCletchie has died at the age of 61.